Hello everybody, this is Abraham with North Shore Computer Services and uh, what we have here is an interesting specimen. It's an external hard drive that uh, was not dropped but it was accidentally uh, misused and the <coughs> the plug for the cable has disintegrated. Okay. So this is a Seagate hard drive. To fix a problem like this, uh, it's a fairly simple fix. We're going to need a guitar pick. Inside of the Seagate is a regular hard drive. Just insert the guitar pick into a side like that. Cracks it open. You can use another one. Now, there's two types of locks on here. There is a physical lock that latches into the, so metal latches into the plastic. And there is a uh, tape. So the tape on the inside, the double-sided tape, is what's holding, kind of uh, uh, securing the two halves together. So the two pieces work um, work together, you know, the physical locks and the tape. So without much of a damage, we just use the guitar picks, get it open, get it unlocked, and inside is a hard drive. Now, if you want to reuse for some reason the uh, case. If you open it carefully like this, it's it's not bent out of shape. It will be reusable. And this is the tape that I'm talking about. Okay. Next, all we have to do is pull the hard drive out. Use some kind of pick. As you can see, there is not much protection for the hard drive, so when it falls, it really gets damaged. Uh, one thing that these manufacturers rely on is the automatic head park. So when uh, electronics senses that the hard drive is in free fall, it will park the heads. So as you can see, the connector is completely, completely messed up. It's actually missing. But on the Seagates, it's not really a problem. Because in order to read the hard drive, all you have to do is remove the adapter. That's a USB to SATA converter. I happen to have a one from a different hard drive that I've uh, taken apart before put it back on and there you go now this one is not identical this one is a slim this one is not slim but it'll work so I'll just plug it in and uh, I'm sure it's gonna work there it is recognizing I can feel the hard drive spinning up It's being recognized by the system right now. And uh, I have it on a screen. So believe me, it's accessible. Uh, so that's all for this repair. Now I want to show you, in contrast, what could happen if you don't buy Seagate. Okay, now. Interestingly enough, some manufacturers, such as Western Digital, that manufacture these passport drives, uh, do not follow the same procedure. So if something happens on a Western Digital, uh, SOL. So to open a Western Digital, similar kind of procedure, does not have a tape. 
you just take a guitar pick and stick it right here right on top and get the locks opened up stick it on this side basically okay so for those people who have uh, the my passport be very careful with it so here is the passport drive as you can see there is no adapter here the USB is mounted directly onto the hard drive board and this presents quite a few problems and problems are if the connector is broken and the mo motherboard is cracked or broken it's really difficult to uh, find the replacement donor board so to be honest if I was to make a recommendation I would never recommend Western digital hard drives um, they're much cheaper so people go with them but the cheapness come from the fact that they are not manufacturing this uh, converter board. So there is a cost in uh, the board, cost in the connectors. So all that cost is uh, spared for you on here so they deliver a better price. But with better price, you're losing quite a bit as far as ability to... Uh, have an extra uh, way to get stuff off of the drive so this one here is junk uh, it's got other problems with it but uh, this is the war of the titans you got uh, huh, interesting thing this one here came from seagate seagate is a hard drive manufacturer they're using Samsung hard drives inside of the Seagate. This means that that's just the Seagate brand. Um, these manufacturers are weird. Um, here is a Seagate drive. So Seagate does manufacture hard drives, but sometimes it's cheaper for Seagate to buy other brand hard drive and put it into its own brand uh weird weird very weird i don't get it thank you for watching subscribe uh give me a thumbs up if you like it thumbs up thank you